good, man. You know, get ready to shoot this album cover to the next album. Definition of pain, you know what I'm saying? We trying to step it up a little bit. You know what I'm saying? Trying to do different shit, but keep it authentic. Keep it, you know what I'm saying? In the pocket with the J Stone All Money In brand. You know what I'm saying? Man, that shit crazy. I like work. You know what I'm saying? My mom died before I was like, I was barely three years old. You know what I'm saying? My auntie had to raise a nigga. Me and my brother in the same household. Till I was about 13, 14, my brother got killed. About a year later, my auntie died too. After that, it was jail. Going to jail back to back. Going to group home back to back. You know what I'm saying? My PO sent the nigga to jail because I ran away from a group home. Ain't that some shit? Must be a reason why a nigga live the life he live. You feel what I'm saying? Nigga got shot and all that. Damn, cuz. I'm in the MLM's truck riding with the paramedics. I don't know where I'm headed. I thought I was about to die. They like, nah, you straight. You about to live. Heaven to hell, hell to heaven. Shit, I don't know. It's when I knew I was chosen. Sunny Benz, me and Stone, you know that he rolling Like the 60s motherfucker, you know where we going Gotta get straight to this cash, you know it ain't folding Yeah So we taking you right here to the county jail You know what I'm saying, this where a nigga have to go You know what I'm saying, do some time right here You know what I'm saying I got a song called County Jail on the album You know what I'm saying, so we bringing it right here You know, I was telling the story of how I, had to go inside the, you know, the blood dorm, you know what I'm saying? And I'm a crip, so I had to go in there. They asked me where I was from. And when I told them where I was from, you know what I'm saying? They like, yeah, man, it's some phase you gotta catch. You know what I'm saying? A couple niggas you gotta get down with before you make that bed up. All right, let's run it, get to the back. You know what I'm saying? Push some bunks back, you know what I'm saying? Squabbled a few dudes, and shit, I made my bed up. I was good to go, you know what I'm saying? Hey, what's up, man? Thank you, man. Thank you. Appreciate it, man. All right. Now the table's a turn. They went from get up against the wall, face the wall, put your hands up, wiggle your toes. All that bullshit. You know what I'm saying? Now they pulling up, talking about they like the joint I did with Davey. What type of shit is that? Crazy. Yeah. Why the niggas say they chosen? I'm really chosen. Why the niggas say they down for me when they be folding? I've been trying to get that money back that they be owing. Concept, right? I mean, it's working. It's different. It's gonna be different. I imagine that's the cover, right? Mm -hmm. It's different. No it's one does different. that like nah, that. So that's I what we want to do. I ain't never seen nobody do that. And when you think of, when I think of painting, I think, I mean, you could, you could correct me if I'm wrong. It's like picking up the pieces to be resilient. Is to feel broken. Yeah. And pieces, and that's up to you to be resilient and get together. Yeah. You know, and you've had to do that you know, multiple times in your life. Hell yeah, minus your back, man. So that's what it is, man. But um, yeah, lead us, lead us down the way, brother. All right, come on.
got this right here. Just telling my story. Niggas hate, let them hate. This don't make me great. I'm taking time with these albums, gotta make them wait. I remember stacking thousands, with a major weight. Now niggas went legit in a major way. And I'm about to go on tour, niggas state to state. Nigga, I used to curb serve to hit that interstate. I had to hit the pen with game bangers in the great. Trips to Vegas to put food on the dinner plate. But now a nigga rapping about to buy a mansion. I was eight years old with dreams of living lavish. Holy tax and questions, I ain't got no answer. Alright, so right now we visiting my brother and my mom's grave. You know what I'm saying? My brother was buried on top of my mom's. You know what I'm saying? Um, yeah, man, so we right here, man, revisiting the past and shit, man, you know, some of the shit that I done been through, some shit that I had to witness, you know what I'm saying, my mom died when I was three, my brother died when I was like 14, you feel what I'm saying, I had to witness them burying my brother on top of my mom, you feel me? Demonstration. Demonstration. Going up, nigga, all I know is elevation. elevation Definition of pain I was hustling in the rain Trying to stack me some chains Nigga, just to buy a chain But that didn't You know what I'm saying? My mom had three kids, three boys Me, my older brother, and my little brother You know what I'm saying? My brother Alvin, my, my older brother Alvin He was one of the ones that You know what I'm saying? I was close to out of all of them Because, you know what I'm saying? We both was raised in the same household together You know what I'm saying? And, uh, you know, he would teach me everything about the streets, you know what I'm saying? He would teach me, you know, the do's and don'ts and just how to program to be a man, you know what I'm saying? At an early age, you know what I'm saying? Um, so he passed early, man. I was only like 14. He was only like 15, you know what I'm saying? Too young, way too young. That's one of the main reasons why I go hard today, you know what I'm saying? Just shit like that, cause I know bro, you know what I'm saying, somewhere, you know what I'm saying, watching the nigga, so yeah, that's why I go hard. My mom's, yeah, she died in 1989. I was only three years old, you know what I'm saying? Way too young to understand what was going on. Way too young to understand what the fuck really happened and shit like that. Until later on, I started just putting pieces together myself, you know what I'm saying? I found out the police killed my mama, you know what I'm saying? But, uh, yep. When she passed, my auntie had to raise me and my brother Alvin in the same household. Then, like, shit, by the time we was teenagers, my brother passed, and by like a year later, my auntie that raised me, she passed too, you feel me? So it was just me by myself. You know what I'm saying? I had to figure this shit out on my own. Got back from my tour, got back in album mode. Make myself a millionaire, that's on Alvin's soul. The journey of a thousand miles begin with one step. Last of a dying breed is still so I'm covered. Yeah. You know what time it is. Nigga ain't playing. Nigga ain't playing. Oh, the shoes. Yeah. Huh, what'd you say, Pac? I say if you help me, you something. All right. All right. Yeah, man. Hell yeah. Keep making your dad proud, boy. Right, good looking, man. For real, for real, man. Love you, love you, All right. Hell yeah. Shit. Nigga, my cousin trained me in. You should stay right here. Uh. My cousins, uh, Sachi and Pani, my auntie, uh, Gwen stay right here. You know what I'm saying? We stayed upstairs right here in apartment 25. It's the building where I grew up at right here, 67th Street and 8th Avenue. Right in the heart of the 60s. This apartment building right here, apartment 25, that's where a nigga stayed at. That's where I grew up at, you know what I'm saying? That's where I wrote my first rap, where I recorded my my first song, everything right here, you know what I'm saying? I was raised right here with my auntie and my brother, right here in this household, you know what I'm saying? For some years, we used to crack. We used to be a hundred homies out here. Niggas used to be shooting dice right there. We used to be shooting dice in the back. Homies squabbling in the back. I used to see all that shit out my, out my window. I used to look out the window and see the homies squabble. My best friend Boo stayed right there, you know what I'm saying? 
This is my folks stayed at up here, apartment 16. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, man, this shit bring back memories. Crazy, man. You know what I'm saying? I just thought I'd bring the music back home. You know what I'm saying? Because this is where it started at. You know what I'm saying? I used to watch the box, watch all the music videos right here. You know what I'm saying? And I figured it out right here. This is what I wanted to do. I wanted to rap. You know what I'm saying? My auntie gave me a karaoke machine with the mic. And shit, I got cracking. You know what I'm saying? I'm going through boxes, finding instrumentals. Dr. Dre, DJ Quick, NWA, Bone Thugs and Harmony. It was a rap, that's all I needed. You know what I'm saying? This is where we used to meet up at, you know what I'm saying? All the all the kids in the building, we used to meet up right here at these stairs and shit and figure it out. Right here is when I knew what I wanted to do. We was all right here watching the box. Just came outside, that bone does a harmony uh video, Douglas Ruggers Bone. I'm like, nigga, this what we on. We on this thug shit, nigga, and we nigga, we from the rap, period. we headed to uh 37th drive and uh St. Andrew's place, you know what I'm saying? A little group home. I don't know if it's still there, but we're gonna go check it out. It was a group home that I was at, you know what I'm saying? You know, for a little bit till I ran away and had to go pursue my dreams. Home and it's my time to back. I'm feeling like the loc is on his own. And when I sleep, I feel like I gotta hold my crown. Rest in peace and nip. I'm feeling like they did my homie wrong. Damn, that's some shit I never fathomed. All right, so we right here on 37th and uh, St. Andrew's place. You know what I'm saying? Right here. You know what I'm saying? Where the group home was at. You know what I'm saying? Back in like 2002. I probably was like 16. You know what I'm saying? Right here. Um, after I had got shot and went went to jail, I, didn't, I, I never made it home. You know what I'm saying? I never made it home. They sent me here. I wasn't here that long, bro. I don't even think I remember nobody name like that. You know what I'm saying? Niggas was hating on me anyway, you feel what I'm saying? I brought a little shorty dude, you feel me? On the late night, you feel me? They told on me the next day. The dude that owned the place, he like, yeah, man, we gonna have to figure out another spot for you, man. Like, we gonna have to uh, take you back to Juvenile Hall. I'm like, what? He like, yeah, man, today. I'm like, today? He like, yeah, I'm like, all right, well, let me just go pack my shit, man. You give me about, like, 30 minutes. He like, all right, cool. He turned his back. I was packing my shit and out this back door. You know what I'm saying? I wasn't going back to jail. Hell no. Nah. Hell no. Nah. I went to the hood, changed clothes and shit. Pulled up on my homie Scatterbrain. Like, what's up, man? Let's work. Like, let's work. He had a studio. He was, like, one of the only homies in the hood with a studio. So, shit, I'm like, nigga, let's work. We did a song, shit, that day. Yeah, yeah so where we going next is, uh, you know what I'm saying, where I'm building my studio from scratch. You know what I'm saying? It ain't all the way done, but you know what I'm saying? We getting there. You know what I'm saying? We getting there, so. I can feel yeah. it being the end. I can feel the bend my soul. Yeah. Riding down Florence with a couple warrants in the form. Watch me shoot my shot, you know I'm always scoring. I'm always touring with a burner, I give no warnings. How you say you my dog and you turn informant? You rap niggas get extorted, then get escorted. They say I got expensive habits, they just can't. Yeah, afford. man, so be back at my studio. You know what I'm saying? While well, I'm building my studio from scratch. You know, this the front entrance right here. I'm thinking, you know, this can be like a little reception area or something, you know what I'm saying? And right here, we under construction right here. This is another little room that, you know, we working on right now. You know what I'm saying? And this gonna be the room where all the magic happens, you feel me? Right here. 
right here, you know what I'm saying? You know, the mixing board, all the equipment and shit right here, the speakers and all that shit right here, you feel me? Got the, got the big glass booth, you know what I'm saying? So I'll go in here and make my magic. I'm ahead of the game, plus my music bang. It's still like them slots of boyhood unit days. It ain't your fault that you bang, that's where you was raised. But just hope you make it out and see shit change. Why you on Instagram, let your clip hang. Real killers move in silence, let your clip bang. It's fucked up, we talk violence. Yeah, man, so we just, uh, we just wrapped up shooting. Um, definition of pain. Um, Stone could probably give you a little bit more background as to the title. Um, but uh, we touched a couple of different personal landmarks and stones that really helped shape him into the man and to the artist that he is. I came over here to the future of uh, 25A Studios, man. So it's going to be exciting times. I mean, he gave me the tour earlier. So uh, talk to him a little bit about the, um, the album title and kind of the series going from I mean, definition yeah, of loyalty yeah. to definition of pain. Yeah, definition of pain. That's the next project. You know what I'm saying? You know, that's basically like all the stuff that I've been through in my life, on my journey to success, you know what I'm saying? Just all the pain that I dealt with, you know what I'm saying? Just getting to where I'm at, you know what I'm saying? And uh, definition of loyalty, you know, we did that, you know what I'm saying? Now we had definition of pain, but it's cold because Nip gave me these titles, you know what I'm saying? He gave me the definition of loyalty, like, man, you should keep going with definition of pain sacrifice, success, you know what I'm saying? So, I'm keeping that going, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna do all four of them, so, yeah, stay tuned. Yeah. I don't give a fuck. I don't care what you say, nigga. I just hopped off stage, nigga. On my way to get paid, nigga. Got permit to zine on the plane with us. Whip we landing, switch language. That's a long flight, so they pay.